made its first visit in history to Texas. 60,000 packed the stands at Houston to see the unbeaten cadets meet a formidable opponent, Rice Institute, then leading the Southwest Conference. After a hard-fought first quarter, Rice's able passer, Alvin Hartman, fired to Buddy Dial for 18 yards. Hartman went back to pitch again. Dial leaped high to make the catch and score for Rice. For the first time, the cadets were behind. They didn't panic. Caldwell's overhead to Lonely End, Bill Carpenter ate up 18 yards. Now, Caldwell tosses to Anderson in the flat. Bob's run made a first down on the Rice 16. Then came Anderson's option running pass. A great catch by Carpenter in the end zone made it 7-all at the half. In the final quarter, it looked as if the Black Knights were going down to defeat at last. A furious Rice onslaught advanced ever closer to the Army goal. But the cadets stemmed the tide. Then they broke through to block a field goal attempt, and the Owls were beaten off. Only a little more than a minute of play remained. Caldwell's pass to Anderson moved the ball to the Army 36. Then came one of the electrifying plays of the season. Caldwell loosed a pinpoint pass. Captain Dawkins took it on the dead run. Raced away, a desperation tackle jostled him at the 10, but he regained stride and scored. In a sensational last-minute comeback, Army beat Rice 14-7 and marched on undefeated. <laughs>